Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's very quick video, I want to talk about how to keep your reptiles cool in the summer. Before we get started, I ask that you please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and away we go. So the way that I keep my reptiles cool in summer is by having air conditioning. Now, I know not everyone is fortunate enough to have air conditioning, and so I'm going to talk about other ways to keep reptiles cool in summer, or if your air conditioning simply isn't cutting it, how you can keep them cool. If you don't have air conditioning, I would consider it. If you can get a window unit for your reptile room, that'd be great too, but there are other ways to keep them cool such as increasing air circulation in the enclosure itself if your enclosure doesn't have a full screen top and it just has like a couple sections for ventilation i would try increasing the airflow that way more air can get into the enclosure to cool it down another good idea is to lower your heat source so say you have a, a heat mat or a basking bulb and you have it on at all times or like just during the day what you can do is decrease the temperature by a few degrees or in some cases altogether because it's just too warm in the room another thing you can try is to increase the airflow in your home or the reptile room itself which would be by opening any windows or by putting fans and allowing the circulation of air throughout the room if you open your windows and it's hot outside it's definitely going to be hot in your house and the very least you can do is have like a nice breeze coming in you know another thing that you'll want to do is decrease the activity in the room so if you live in your reptile room like your reptile room is your bedroom spend less time in there because your body heat and your activity in the room is going to increase the uh heat of the room the ambient temperature of the room and so if you can keep like dogs and people out of there and movement out of there in general that's gonna help and also decrease the lighting of the room so if you have really bright warm lights in your room you can turn them off you can also move the reptiles out of that room to a lower floor of the house or you can move them into a darker section of the house where it'll be cooler so say you keep your reptiles on the second floor heat rises so the first floor of the house is going to be a lot cooler than the second floor and during summer perhaps you can just move them downstairs on really warm days those are my tips fortunately the only enclosures i ever really have to worry about are the axolotl tanks sometimes the uh house gets a little too warm but usually our air conditioning cools it down in a matter of two days and so I don't really have to worry about it too much. I'm very fortunate in that way. I can't imagine how stressful it would be to try and keep your reptiles cool, especially like with my European friends. Oh my gosh, I, I don't know how they do it every summer. Like I'd be stressed out all the time. But those are my recommendations on how to cool your reptiles down in the summer. Let me know if you have any tips and tricks that I missed down below. I thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. Please let me know if you did by leaving a like or a comment. Also subscribe to the notification bell. And with all that said, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.